everybody! Today I'll be working on a 12 by 16 canvas, but I will also be pouring on this porcelain bowl. I was recently contacted by Dowin. Their company makes uh, porcelain dinnerware, and they asked me if they could send me some products to pour on, so I said yes. So, I do have my colors picked out here in front of me. The first color I have is Folk Art, and it is White Pearl. My second color is from Artist Loft, and it is Metallic Cobalt Blue. And my third color is from Liquitex Basics, and it's Cadmium Red Light Hue. Um, all my paints are mixed with uh, Liquitex Pouring Medium, Floetrol, and Water, and... Uh, no, I didn't add any silicone or anything. So I am going to um, do a little bit of prep work and I will be right back. Okay guys, so as you can see, I put the bowl is on top of the canvas. I put a cup underneath it and set the bowl on top. And I've already taken my uh, white pearl and just covered the bowl with the white pearl. The only prep work that I did to the bowl was I wiped it off with um, isopropyl alcohol and that was it. Let it dry. That was it. All right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take each one of these colors and I'm just going to start pouring them on in different areas and just see what happens. so I was going to do a little bit more but I really like how this is looking it's just simple but really pretty at the same time so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna move the bowl off of the canvas and then I will be back okay guys so I got the bowl moved and then I took the rest of my pearl white and I covered the outside so now I'm just gonna play around a bit and see what happens I'm gonna take my stick and I'm just going to pull some of this color in. Although, <laughs> it doesn't look like it's really going. There's a lot, there's really a lot of the um, pearl white in the middle. But I kind of like the effect that it left, right, like the the swirls that it left. So I'm just going to move it around a bit and see what happens and then we're going to go from there. Okay guys, so it's been about a half an hour. I'll take you in for a little bit of a close-up. As you can see, the um, cobalt, actually both the cobalt and the orange started feathering. So that's the reason that I left it. Um, I was gonna mess a little more, but I really like how that looks. Look at that, it looks so cool. And sometimes simple is, is better. Sometimes just a simple pattern 
uh, looks really, really cool. All right, so then we've got this. Um, this painting looks really, really cool too. It's got a little bit more going on than the bowl. You can see all the natural cells popping up. And the colors are just amazing. That pearl white is just my favorite. <laughs> I love using it. And you can see in a couple areas, like right there, the um, kind of the swirly design from the uh, drip off of the bowl stayed. I got to keep a little bit of that. So that's cool. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and let these dry. And then I will be back so you can see them. All right. So stay tuned. Okay guys, so here's the painting and the bowl all dry. Take in for a little bit of a close up. This dried really, really nice. I love how it, it feathered. It looks really, really cool. And these bowls are um, very uh, nice quality. They seem very sturdy and the paint adhered quite well to the surface. So that's nice. And it's just a simple, uh, elegant design. So I like that. And then here's the painting. And it looks really good. The colors stayed nice. There's some areas that I like. Like there's one area. I love the contrast of the pearl finish to like the matte finish right there. And then over here's a couple areas. It looks really cool. I like that. And then of course I got all the natural cells that came through. All right, so I like what I got here from the runoff. And the bowl turned out amazing. All right, so stay tuned for more videos. I have three of these bowls to do. So stay tuned for those. All right, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, Check out my links in my description and have a great day.